so what was your first question arham hmm? open your that um question paper everybody am i audible okay so first question was ki what is the chemical formula of ammonium sulfate so ammonium sulfate first question ammonium sorry ammonium phosphate so now you tell me what is uh, how will you write ammonium ha huh? anybody yes rasi ma'am uh, yeah no i can't hear you rasi yes hello ma'am can you hear me yeah no does your voice is not audible maybe your network issue ha ha anybody ma'am ma'am ammonium sulfate is nh4 uh, after the two in brackets and so what sop so4 so it's phosphate so p1 ma'am wait i'll write it's... it in the chat box ha huh. aram you tell me you don't know what is phosphate don't know okay so phosphate is po4 and ammonium is nh4 okay nh4 and po4 and nh4 is having two plus 1 and po4 is having minus 3 so Same what we will we will cross multiply this then what we will get we will get nh4 thrice and po4 that's it okay yeah hello advika sorry ma'am no, no, there's instruction going on here so the internet is very weak yeah it's okay so so we'll discuss the next one next one was what give the difference between a cation and an anion now you tell me the difference between cation and an anion cation and an anion difference um cation has positive and an uh, an anion has negative yes example then do we have to give example also in the exam obviously you have to positively charged ion and this one is negatively charged ion now what is the example of this na plus k plus mg2 plus nacl ha huh? not any not any any separate and not like uh, so na man i have a, like it's a question in general ma'am ma'am since na mm -hmm. is a like positive and anion is cl ma'am so will it be positive mm -hmm. or negative like nacl what will be the charge on it no we will consider this thing separately so na is plus and then cl is minus okay yes ma'am okay so in anion it will be cl minus it will be boron it will be f minus o minus o2 minus okay and etc got it adham razi shazan any doubt hello can you hear me no ma'am yes razi no ma'am ma'am may i go p in which i did test now it is substance ma'am may i go and clean what what come again हाउ मच Now can I have the answer? Yes. Ma'am, N A is twenty three. Hmm. Ma'am, then is? Uh, X is one. Yes. Ma'am, uh, then uh, it's twelve. Yeah. And ma'am, that's forty eight. Yes, sixteen three forty eight. Sixteen into three years. Hmm. So now, what is the answer total? Ma'am, if you add it, it's eighty four. Yes, eighty four. You. So everybody did this question. Okay. Adham, everybody. This is like the easiest question in the whole. Ah. Mm hmm. <laughs> Yeah, Adam, you did. Okay, so yes, I think I did this question. Okay, next question. Next question was molecular mass of water is eighteen. Your water molecular mass is how much? Let me write H two. H two molecular mass is how much? Eighteen u. What will be the number of molecules of water in eighteen gram of water? Sorry, ha. Huh. What will be the number of molecules in how much? In eighteen gram of water. So it will be how much? Hmm. Anybody? Ma'am, can I tell this one? Yeah. Uh, ma'am, uh, ma'am, this zero two two into ten. Yes. Simply Avogadro's number. Avogadro's number. Yes. Everybody did this question? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Next one. Number I didn't specify it was Avogadro's number. I just wrote six point. Ah, ma'am, it's okay. Yeah, yeah. So how many moles are present in four point six gram of Na? How many? Moles are present in this much gram of Na. So how will how many ha huh? how many moles? So you have to write first formula of what of number of moles. Number of moles is equal to what given mass upon molar mass given mass of Na. 
डिवाइडेड बाय एटॉमिक मास एटॉमिक मास ऑफ एन एर what now what is the given mass given mass is 4.6 gram I'm and 4. what is the atom grams. atomic mass of ma'am it is ha so yes ma'am 4.6 by 23 so it will be how much 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 0
Ma'am, 0 0.1. Yeah, good. 0 0.1 mole. Now, what is the third sub part? Third sub part is you have to find concentration, not concentration you have to find of this yes, NaCl. So, it will be what? The formula of this concentration is? Ma'am, mass of solute upon mass of solution into 100. Uh, no. Mass of solute, number of moles of solute upon volume of solution. And here, what is the number of moles of solute? We already got this 0 0.1. And what is the volume of solution? Volume of solution is this much. One liter. No. One liter is volume. One liter. So it's 0 0.1. It's 0 0.1 mole per liter. Okay. I think answer correct or wrong. <laughs> yes, tell me. I think I've also done this one. I got I think I got the same answer. Okay, good. Next one. Eight. I might, I might not have. <laughs> okay, it's okay. So you understood now that here it's asking first you have to find simply this molar mass. Molar mass is simply addition of these two sodium and chlorine. Second, you have to find number of moles given mass upon molar mass. You got this concentration formula is number of moles of solute. We already got this number of moles of solute 0 0.1 upon volume. Volume is given here in the question that one liter of water. So it will be divided by one. Okay, next. Next question. Next question everybody got is the toughest one maybe. Okay, so in photosynthesis, six molecules of carbon dioxide, six molecules, uh, molecules of CO2 combined with an equal number of water molecules through a complex series of reaction to give what? To give a molecules of glucose that having a molecular formula of molecular formula C6H12O6. This is the molecular formula of glucose. Right now, next, how many gram of water would be required to produce 18 gram of glucose? How many gram of water means um, gram of water? We have to find gram GRM. Okay, gram of water. How many gram of water required to produce 18 gram of glucose? So compute the volume of water so consumed, assuming the density is given. Density is how much? Density of water is 1 gram cm cube. Now, tell me, anybody. Uh, Advika, you did this? Yes, yes, oh, ma'am. Nice. Okay, so first what we have to write, first we have to write a chemical reaction uh, of this glucose. So it, it will be C, 6 molecules of CO2 means 6 molecules of CO2 plus 6 H2O also. Um, it is combining with what? This 6 molecules of CO2 is combining with equal number of water molecule okay equal number of water molecules so plus 6 h2o okay simple six molecules of co2 is combining with equal number of water molecules so six and six six co2 plus six h2o giving here you will write chlorophyll and below it sunlight it will produce what it will produce this glucose means six c6 h12o6 and plus some oxygen, 6O2, because in question it's saying that here 6O2 is there. So it will produce this much. 6CO2 plus 6H2O giving glucose and oxygen. So first we have to find the molar mass of oxygen. Molar mass of, sorry, molar mass of glucose, C6H2O6. It will be how much? Um, 12 into 6 plus 12 plus 6 into 16. So mm, 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 it will be 180. 180 gram per mole. Okay. Till this much understood or any doubt. Arham. Next. From above reaction, we see that what? That one molecule of glucose is formed from one molecule of glucose. Uh, where is it? Hmm. One molecule of glucose is formed from six molecules of water. One molecules of glucose is forming from what from six molecules of water of h2o okay water i'm writing so six into molecular mass of h2o will be 18 hai na? molecular mass of water is 18 so it will be how much 108 gram so 18 gram of glucose c6 h12o6 needs how many molecules of water 108 upon 180 into 18 grams of water so it will be um if we will divide this uh, uh, it will be some eight point something eight point eight sorry ten point eight 
gram of water. Now it's asking your volume. So you will simply write the formula of volume is what? Mass of water upon density. Mass of water upon density of water. Razi, you did this question or not? Upon density. So it will be how much? 10.8 upon 1 gram cm. This thing, so answer is 10.8 cm cube. Nobody got Mom. this? Mom. Mm. Mom, I did this question. Mom, I got the answer also. Mom, may I send you uh, the screenshot so that you can check my answer? Well, I think I did okay. it different. Thanks. Um, Mom, I don't think I've done this one. Okay. Okay. Okay, Razi, you send me. Okay, Mom. I'll check. Advika, you did this or not? Sorry, my mom. Sorry, my mom. I had got to the washroom. Ma'am, which question are we doing right now? Yes. Oh, yes, ma'am. And this one, I've done it. Ma'am, I've done it. You got the same answer, 10.8? Yes, ma'am. Okay, good. So, Arham, it's okay, Arham, it's okay. First, you have to find the molar mass. Then see, it's saying that one molecule of glucose is having six molecules of water. So, first, we will find the molar mass of water. It's what? Mama, it's how much? Okay, where? In WhatsApp? Yes, ma'am, in the group. Okay, in the group. Hmm. So... One molecule of glucose requires six molecules of water. So 880 gram of glucose requires 618. One gram of glucose will require this much. Yes, it's correct, Razi. Very nice. Mm. Thank you, ma'am. Good. Good one. Okay. So next question. Next question is what? Next, maybe everybody. Wait, just a Then everybody is? Yeah. So next question is what? You have to find what? Find the number of copper atom present in. You have to find number of this copper atom. Um, I haven't done that one. Why, Arham? Present in how much? 10 gram of 22 carat gold. So 22 carat gold means 22 out of 24. Okay. So mass of copper here. From this, you will simply... Uh, simply will get this mass of copper. Mass of copper is what? 22 carat gold. So it's in question only it's giving key. 22 carat gold means 22 out of 24. And here it's saying 10 gram. So into 10 is equal to? No, 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 no. It will be mass of copper will be how much? Hmm? No, I don't know. How will you find mass of copper, Razi? No, I don't know. Okay, okay. Razi. Razi or Advika? Mom, uh, mom, is it 25 by 3 into 10 upon 100? Uh, no. 2 by, 20, 2 by 24 into 10. What? Mom, 2 by 24 into 10 grams. Why because 2? Of the total. Mom, you're dividing it by 24. Mom, it was given the question itself. It's, uh, yeah. 2 upon 24 into 10, right? Yes, sir. So yes, your, sir. Yeah. So your number of moles of copper will be how much? It's asking number of copper atoms. So first we will... Yes, ma'am. Ma so so first... 2, by, 2, 2 by 24 into 10 by 6.35 uh, into 6.022 into 10 to the power which is Avogadro's number. Yes, 63.5. And then what you have to find? Number of atoms. Number of atoms of Cu is equal to number of moles into Avogadro's number. So this whole thing... Ma'am, shouldn't it be 6.35? What? No, it should be 63.5. No, 63.5. Oh, okay, okay, right. Okay, it's fine. So wrong. No, 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 ma'am. In one okay. part, I've written 63.5. One part, I've written 6.35. Okay. So, ninth one also done. Razi, you got it, Adham? Ninth question. And now we will discuss tenth one. Yeah. Tenth one is the easy. Tenth one is the easy. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma hmm. So, Adham will tell me tenth one. Arham, yes, and first apart, what is the mass of mass of 0 0.5 mole of NH3? Mass of 0 0.5 mole of NH3. Your N is what? N is 14 U and H is 1 U. So, hmm? um, um, 8.5. Good. How come? 14 uh, plus 3 is what? 17. So, 17 into... 0 0.5 is nothing but 8.5 grams, right? Okay, good. Um, man, how, how? How? Oh, yes, ma'am, I got it. No, it's given, no? Zero got, it, got it, ma'am, got it. Okay, seconds apart. 
कैलकुलेट द नंबर ऑफ पार्टिकल्स इन थर्टी वन ग्राम ऑफ पी फोर मॉलिक्यूल यू हैव टू कैलकुलेट नंबर ऑफ पार्टिकल्स नंबर ऑफ पार्टिकल्स इन हाउ मच इन थर्टी वन ग्राम ऑफ पी फोर मॉलिक्यूल्स Was it P eight or P four? Because I P4. remember it was written P eight. No, I remember it should be P four. Check once. It's P four. P four, na? Yes. Hmm. So you have to find what number of particles in this much gram of P four molecules. So how to do? How to solve this question? Come on, anybody. Four into zero point uh, six point zero two two into ten power twenty three or like. Avogadro's constant. Why? Because it would need four moles. First, you will yes, first you will find this molar mass, na? The molar mass of P four molecule. <laughs> molar Mom, mass will just be uh thirty one. That will be thirty one by one two four six point zero two two into ten raised to the power twenty three. Okay. Uh, okay. Mom, it will be one twenty three to one twenty four. Yeah. Then that's what I said. One twenty four. Molar 24. mass is. Okay, okay, one twenty-four. Yes, ma'am. And molar mass is thirty-one, mm. so it will become four again. Okay, okay. Let's so write stepwise first. See, number of particle formula of number of particle is what given mass. Number of given upon molar mass into Avogadro. Into Avogadro's constant. Hmm. And so your given mass is how much? Thirty-one. Thirty-one divided by uh sorry. Four. Thirty-one divided by one twenty-four. Into six point zero two two into ten to the power twenty three. So it will be zero point two five into ten to zero point two five. Just wrong. Okay, but but why zero point two five? Because thirty one divided by one one hundred and twenty four will uh will be uh zero point two five. See, if we will calculate only this part, then it will be how much? Hmm. In Dash into some twenty three, so it will be how much? Ah, uh, zero point two five. One point five something. Zero one by two. One by two. One by means one point. It will be around one by two, like one. No, so approx this much, na? Yes. Okay. Now, so. So number of particles you got this much. That's it. Your molar mass of P four is already sorry. Ma'am, but I didn't approximate it. Ma'am, I wrote three point zero one one by two. Ah, like I didn't okay. approximate it to one point. Yes, that's okay. Good. So this much gram is already given. So first you have to find the molar mass and then the number of particles is this. So you can calculate this. Okay. Next. So ma'am, I got my final answer is one point five zero five gram. I mean one point five zero five into ten raised to the power twenty three molecules. Ha. Huh. Correct. Don't you see? One point five to ten per twenty. Next sub part. Next sub part is what? Ah, uh, find the number of moles. You have to find number of moles in how much? In eighty seven gram of K two S four. Okay. So first we will find the molar mass of this K two S four. Now what is the molar mass of K two S four? Hmm. Sim simple. Simple question. The molar or molar mass or moles? No, no molar yeah. mass. Hmm. Oh, ma'am, it's one seventy four gram. One seventy four, yeah, one seventy four gram per mole. Now we will find this number of moles. Number of moles formula is given mass upon molar mass. Zero point five. Ma'am, so the answer is zero point five. Zero point five moles. Yes, good. Zero point five mole. Good one. Next question eleven. Eleven. What is ma'am? The, the this question was very confusing. Very confusing. Okay. Yes, ma'am. It was very confusing. So you have to find the missing data, na? First is what species property. No, I haven't done. Ma'am, I got a few. Ma'am, after that, like we got lost. Number of moles. This is H two O. This is C O two. And here, Na atom. And here is what Mg Cl two. And your number of moles is given for this thing. You have to find this. You have to no, find. No, I couldn't do this question. Okay, Adam. It's okay. And zero point five is this. Now number of particles for this you have to find. This is given into ten to the power twenty three. This you have to find, and this you have to find. And mass, mass is what thirty six gram. You have to find one fifth, one hundred and fifteen, and this. So okay. Now we will start. First we will find H two O number of particles. Okay. First for H two O. So for H two O your Number of moles is already given, 
it's given na number of moles is already given as 2 and your mass is also given 36 mass is also given 36 gram so what is the number of particle formula number of particles is what is number of moles into avogadro's constant yes ma'am number of moles into avogadro's constant no just now i discussed no number of particles see this number of particles number of moles into na so here also you will write number of moles and how you will you find number of moles given mass upon molar mass so it will be how much it will be 2 into ha, number of moles is already given na? so no need to calculate 6.022 into 10 to the power 23 so it will be how much 6 to 12 point uh, sorry 1 point 1 1.2044 into 10 to the power 23 simple only you have to find number of particle mole is also given mass is also given this is the formula of number of particle understood next means this we got na? 1 point 1 point 0 sorry 1 1.2044 Four four into ten to the power twenty three. Now for CO two we will calculate. So here second for CO two. So CO two um, number of particle is given for CO two. Number of p I am writing for particle. Okay, is what three point zero one one into ten to the power twenty three. And number of moles is also not given. Even mass is not given. Only particle is given. So how to solve this? And what we uh, first uh, first is number of moles. Okay, first we will find number of moles. So number of moles formula is what? See here. Your number of particle is number of moles into Avogadro's constant. So number of moles, can I write like this? Number of particles upon Avogadro's constant? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, uh, ma hmm. is the answer 0 0.5 moles? 0 0.5. Okay, let me calculate. See, number of particle is how much? This much. And Avogadro's is 6.022 into 10 to the power 23. It's yeah, if you will, uh, ah, zero point five. So this also we got what we got number of moles, zero point five mole. Okay. Next, next is what we have to find mass. So mass of CO two is what? What is mass? Moles into molar mass. Mm -hmm. Yes. Molar mass of CO two. And mole is what? Um, zero point five. Hmm. And molar mass is what of CO two? Forty four. Yes. 44. 44. 22? 22. 22. Good. So this part you didn't get, Aram. Nobody. Razi, you also. I did. I did. You did? Okay. Aram, you didn't? No, I did not. Why? Okay. Next. For NA atom. For mm -hmm. NA atom. For NA atom, only mass is given. No? Mass is given. How much? 115 grams. So for uh, first, what we have to find? First, we have to find number of moles. So number of moles is what? Again, same formula mass upon molar mass so mass is given 115 for na molar mass is how much 23 so it will be 5 plus 5 and uh, ma'am in this question man the particle i got a zero i mean two 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 okay two okay so uh, number of particles number of particle is what what is the formula of number of particle mm -hmm. number of moles given mass uh uh mass number, number, number of moles into into Yes. And what is the number of moles given? Five. 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 Into Avogadro's constant. Six. So it will be how much? Some three point something. Three point zero one one into ten to the power twenty four. Yeah. So this part also we got three point zero one one into ten. It will to the become. It will become like thirty point eleven into ten power twenty three mm. as well. It will be like yes. that. Ah, okay. So. For MgCl2, last. For MgCl2. For MgCl2, only number of moles is given. Na? Only number of moles is given, which is 0 0.5. What we have to find? Number of particle. Number of particle will be how much? Um, um, 3.011 into 10 to the power 23. 3.011. Why? Mom, because number the number of moles is 0 0.5. Then we'll mm. multiply 0 0.5 to 6. Achha, achha, okay, four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it will be 3.011 into 10 to the power 23. So number of particles also we got. It's 3.011 into 10 to the power 23. Next is what? Next what we have to find? Mass. So what is the formula of mass? Just now. Mama, this, huh? Yes, mama got 95 units. 95. Okay, let me calculate. Mass is what? Number of moles. Sorry, number of, mo huh? number of moles into 
molar mass and what is number of moles mm -hmm. what is number of moles of mgcl2 mam 0.5 0.5 uh, oh no 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 uh, what's that oh. 0.5 only okay and what is the molar mass of mgcl2 molar mass of mgcl2 is mg is how much mam 24 you tell me mam chlorine is 35.5 no yes mam 35.5 and mg is 24 and mam i got 95 after that and then uh, yeah 95 so we will calculate we will just simply multiply this it will be it will be how much 47 47.5 gram yes ma'am yeah? okay done 47.5 simple adam got it out is yes, ma'am now i got it but uh, i didn't write it in the test okay it's okay so let us discuss 12th one also okay only two more minutes 12th one Well, uh, first sub part is five moles of CO two and five moles of H two O do not have the same mass. Okay, five moles of CO two and five moles of H two O. You have to verify this. Do not have the same mass. Yes, ma'am. So, ma'am, five moles of CO two is equals to ma'am forty four into five. That is two hundred twenty grams. And for H two O, the molar mass is eighteen grams per mole. And five moles of H two O have mass eight eighteen into five is equals to ninety and ninety. And after five, like five moles of H two O is eighteen into five, na? Yes, ma'am. So both values are not same. Ninety yes, gram and eighteen gram. So both value are not same. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So the answer for five. False. Yeah. Second, two forty gram of calcium. 240 g of calcium and 240 g of magnesium elements have a mole ratio of 3 to 5 so this you have to verify yes, this thing is correct or not mam 240 upon mam uh, you didn't do this question mam that is 6 uh, for mam uh, ca and yeah this mam for mg it is 240 upon 24 that is 10 and then when we will come simplify 6 is to 10 uh, we will get 3 to 5 So it's correct, na? Yes, ma'am. Yes. So this is verified, verified. But first sub part is not verified. Okay. Yes. So done. Any doubt in any of the question, Adam? And uh, Adam Razi, anybody? No. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Okay. Okay. So, okay then. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye, ma'am.